On Coconut Island, they're not just studying marine life. They're also hoping to inspire a new generation of scientists who will help protect our ocean ecosystem. My name is Lily Evanson and I'm from Kamehameha Schools. I'm here today at the Hawaii Institute of Marine Biology with a group of marine science students here in the water who are collecting invertebrate specimens. Our marine science program at Kamehameha Schools has been ongoing for I'm sure over 30 years. I've been aware of it for 27 and this provides our students with an opportunity to get out into the field, get into the water and actually see what researchers at the university level are studying and hopefully uh, select this as a career for themselves. We're looking through the algae for invertebrates. They found crabs and little brittle stars. We're gonna collect them so we can test their sound. And so they have collected everything and separated everything. And now they're trying to think about a hypothesis that they want to test. After we're done, we're going to collect all the animals that we find and return them to the ocean where we collected them from. The algae that is an invasive species will be dried and disposed of. What we're really trying to do with the HIMB education programs is provide meaningful, authentic science experiences that are relevant to Hawaii's communities in terms of um, studying ecosystems and natural systems that are in our own backyards in the Hawaiian Islands. Some of the issues that we're studying in marine science are coral bleaching, coral diseases. So this is a very real issue tied into global warming, um, tied into maintaining the integrity of the Northwest Hawaiian Islands. We're creating these opportunities um, in the hopes of eventually recruiting more of our own students from Hawaii into these critical STEM disciplines, STEM disciplines being the science, technology, engineering, and math, um, particularly in the ocean and marine sciences. We're looking at things um, in terms of marine management, um, conservation, sci uh, research sciences at UH and elsewhere. Um, it's really important that we retain and recruit our local talent into these fields for the future of Hawaii's economy. I just kind of found it interesting and since like we live in the middle of the ocean I thought it'd be nice to actually study it. It was it was really interesting to be able to go out and do research in a real research facility and to get this kind of like experience in um, hands-on activities with like the invertebrates and stuff. Through all of our various programs we have um, we have opportunities for as early as fifth grade elementary to middle school programs that will bring you out to HIMB and Coconut Island to view some of the research and the history of the islands and also there are opportunities for hands-on lab activities where you would identify marine inver invertebrates or um, learn about marine debris, uh, various programs that include those topics. We've had close to several thousand visitors every year. Um, the high school program alone has probably seen 800 students in the last year and those numbers had been growing quite steadily um, since 2005 but last year with the implementation of furloughs, we've seen some effects on the number of schools that are able to come out here to, to partake in these opportunities. Um, but we are hopeful that with the end of furloughs this coming year that, that things will turn around and that we'll have more schools that are able to come out and take advantage of these opportunities.